What is going on, Neo Nation? It's your girl Peggy here. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to the FCC. Yeah, FCC is short for the Fried Chicken Channel. Um, so actually today it's KFCC. Yeah, Kentucky Fried Chicken Channel. <laughs> anyway, KFC in Singapore just came out with a new chicken over here. Um, they call it the Gold Spice Chicken. Yeah, and they claim that it is better than gold. Right. <laughs> okay, so for this gold spice chicken, it is flavored with salted egg, sweet basil, and spicy curry leaves. And I've ordered six pieces of it. So this is like salted egg curry chicken. I don't know, it sounds really interesting. I'm really curious as to how this would taste like. Right, and for the sides today, I got us some fries and mashed potatoes. And new on the dessert menu are these chocolate hazelnut egg tarts. So they are Portuguese egg tarts with chocolate hazelnut sauce in it. Sounds really good. Looks really good too. Okay, uh, let's go for the gold first. Gold spice chicken. Right, let's start with the skin. Ooh. Okay. Gold spice skin. Okay, it's a little spicy um, from the curry and it's also a little sweet okay it has got that um, sweet and savory thing going on um, let's just eat it hmm It's a little sweet, I like that. Okay, the meat tastes um just like the yeah, regular chicken. Actually, it's only the skin with the flavor. The meat inside is the same. Excuse me. Okay, uh, for this gold spice chicken, the flavor um, is only on the skin. <laughs> the meat inside tastes just like their regular uh, spicy chicken. 
but it's good it's a little sweet and savory so i like that I think it's um, like their spicy chicken and then they just added the seasoning powder on it. Yeah, I think that's all there is to it. <laughs> but it's alright. Um, it's definitely better than that honey sesame chicken that they had. That was horrible. This is much better. Okay, um, let's go for the drumsticks. Dip it in cheese. Yeah, I heard a bike outside. I'm a little worried that um, they deliver again, like the last time. The last time I ordered KFC, they delivered my order twice. So I'm a little worried that it's happening again. But okay. cheese fries.
Gonna add some fried chicken loop. So spice chicken. It looks really good on the advertisement. Well, okay, it actually looks quite good um, on the real thing. So yeah, <laughs> this one is good. I would recommend it. Oh yeah, for the fries, I think they have some Excuse me. They have some new um, chocolate fries. Chocolate Nutella fries. Yeah, but it's not available for delivery. That's too bad. But uh, from what I've seen on the pictures on Facebook, it's just fries with Nutella sauce on it, so... <laughs> Ooh. I can't make that myself. Hmm. 
People are like queuing up for it. I'm not a big fan of queuing up for food. Yeah, no matter how nice it is. This mayonnaise is really good. Um, this one is the Japanese mayonnaise. I think the name is Q Pie. K E W P I E. Yeah, Q Pie Japanese mayonnaise. Goes well with everything. Let's go for this one. Ooh. The drumlet. You know, I eat so much KFC that I think KFC, KFC should start sponsoring me. <laughs> hmm. But the thing with sponsored food is that it comes with a lot of rules and restrictions. So 
sometimes I just rather pay for my own food and then I can do and say whatever I want, you know. I've only ever done one sponsored video and um, yeah I didn't really like the experience there are a lot of rules and requirements that I'm not a fan of
mashed potatoes with fried chicken is the best. <laughs>
Excuse me. Okay. <laughs> Let's eat dessert. Finally. <laughs> okay, this one looks good. Let's go for this one. There's chocolate at the bottom too. It's like Ferrero Rocher. Eight times. <laughs> mm. It's very good. And it's not too sweet, so that's good. They should have this on the menu permanently. The crust is really flaky too. It just melts in your mouth.
Right, we are done for today. That chocolate hazelnut tart, that was fantastic. <laughs> I like that the tarts, um, they're very light and flaky and the inside is really soft. So it just melts in your mouth when you eat it. It's fantastic. <laughs> um, it's too bad that this is probably gonna be a, a temporary thing on a menu. You know, they usually change to something else like um, maybe after a month. So if you guys are watching this in Singapore, try it before it's gone. And um, that chicken, uh, what is it called? Gold Spice Chicken. Yeah, uh, it's alright. It's uh, it's very similar to their uh, spicy chicken, but with that um, seasonings on top. So yeah, the flavor is only on the skin itself. The inside, the chicken meat, it tastes the same as their regular chicken. So yeah, the gold spice flavor is only on the skin. But it's overall a... Pretty good chicken. It's very crunchy. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh yeah, so uh, yeah, one of you, some of you were asking me in the comments, I was reading it, and um, you guys were asking like, if, if I were, if I'm able to eat so much in my video, right, how do I stop myself from eating so much on other days when I'm not filming? Well, that's a very good question. Uh, but the thing is, usually after a meal like this, I don't have much of an appetite for the next two days. Yeah, like the, the next day, tomorrow, um, I don't really feel like eating anything. It's like my body just doesn't feel like eating anything after today's meal. So the next few days, my meals will be really light and I'll drink a lot of water. So it's not that hard to not overeat on other days because I already overate today. <laughs> so. You know, it's like my body is still trying to um, process what I just ate today. So, yeah, I hope that answers your question. Okay, so that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching me eat fried chicken. <laughs> if you guys enjoyed today's video, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more eating shows like this. So, uh, yeah, I will see you all in my next video, uh, which will be Sunday. Saturday or Sunday. Yeah, so... Until then, take care and love you. Bye!